This is July 8th, 1992, and we're being entertained by this little bird named Pretty Boy over here. He's sitting on Walter's lap. But now he's, he's gone. <laughs> I can't keep up with him in the okay. camera. Yeah, Pretty Boy, I got your money. Come on. Come on. This is really a smart bird. You guys see Come all the on. tricks he Come can on. do. Come on. Okay. Okay, come on. Here. Nobody will believe this unless they see it in real. Wait a minute. Come on. Over here. One. Get it going, did it? All right, here. Here, right here. Over here. Look. Get over here. I said over here, pretty boy. Over here. Well, he's here. So I'm on camera now, here. so I'm not going to do it. Come on. Over here. Yeah. All right, here. I'm going to get you. John, be quiet. Johnny, be quiet. Here. Be quiet here. so he'll do it, okay? And you know what he's after? This. Yeah, he's like, hide this one. Yeah, I didn't go. <laughs> hey. All right, here. There you are, here. Right here it is. So you're going to give me that, I'm not going to entertain it for you. <laughs> yeah, pretty boy. Thanks, dummy. Right here. Get it. Hey, pretty boy. <laughs> he doesn't want to do it now. They've been doing it for a while while I was getting the camera ready. Now he's not doing it. Hide that and then he'll, uh... Okay, here. Here. Right here. Pretty boy. Pretty boy, come on. Help me here. One. Don't touch, John. Back up. Put your hands down. All right, there's your quarter. Here. All right, here. Okay, here. One, two, three. Here. Here, pretty boy. Take this. One, two, three. Hey, go get it. Hey. Go get it. Get it. He won't do it now just because the camera's on him. Go get it. Go get it. Johnny, stay back. I'm just saying, no way. Who do you have to have do it for me. No, I Come on, I feel sick. Money hungry. It's like he's in everybody in there. Mom. Give me his penny over there, too. Come on, I catch your money. We want money, money, money. I'm going to do this. Oh, please, he's lost in here. Bring it to me. Is that something we're going to see, huh? She wants to take a picture. She wants to take a picture. Once my husband and I took a trip to Michigan. Okay, come on, pretty boy. Give me the cup. Okay, we went to the cup. Okay, here. Oh, yeah. Atlantic City. Okay. Right, okay. I couldn't wait for okay. the ball. You know, I was going to spend the night there. And he had one to see the all the tours and yeah. stuff, you know? He did. He did the whole tour pit. Well, it was a day about like today. It was only a lot, lot hotter. Mm -hmm. He went home. Couldn't find a parking place for love and money. Okay. And we went into the Grey Line place and the tour book that I had. That was stuff. That was supposed to get there 30 minutes, minutes before the tour. Don't be stuck. Hey, <laughs> there you go. This is what you're going to say. Well, she's um, going to just hide it. And my husband's going to hide it. There he is. He's carrying it right to the camera. That's cute. Went in. And this lady called me out. This is Pretty Boy. John, don't scare him with your hand, honey. I'm going to go in the bar. I'm going to go in the bar. No, I live here. I don't know this thing. Well, she was going to go in the bar. You might get all there. <laughs> okay, this is a couple days later. Still getting ready. To, we're getting ready to leave Rhode Island. This is June, July 10th, 1992. This is the twins. <laughs> I mean, Hazel and Marie. They got outfits. They could do the double mint commercial, I guess. They could if they wanted to, couldn't they? <laughs> double mint twins. <laughs> oh, I can't sing the song. I forget how it goes, but they could learn it, I suppose, and we could have. A new set. We could say this is uh, 20 years later in the Double Mint Twins. <laughs> Mom, sing <laughs> Doing the commercial. the snowman. No, you don't want to sing. Yeah. Hazel, have you got any messages to take back to anybody? Tell everybody hello. Okay. 
like and to see them. All right. I don't know when we will get to go because the way things are so high now, you know. We just might pull up one day and say, throw your clothes in a suitcase, we're taking you back to visit everybody. <laughs> that wouldn't be surprising. Yeah. That's something I do on a spur of the moment decision. Well, I do good. things like that. I do. Huh? And you guilty. Yeah, I'm guilty of doing things like that. I really am. I just get an idea to go do something and I'll just go do it. Well, that's the only way to be, really. Yeah, really. True. Seems like minute notice to me is the best. It's just, if you go to plan this, plan that, what do you get? It's appointments at times. Yeah, that's yeah. true. You do. You get you get things never work out the way you've expected yeah, it and right. planned it. John's a lot like that too. He'd rather go do things on the spur of the moment than, than spend months planning. You know, and you got a lot of people who who really work at planning things six months in advance, you know. Huh? I have a plan. Mom's got a plan? Yeah, you are more like that. You want to plan it and organize it and get it all thought out. And me, I just... Have everything cleaned. Yeah. <laughs> Lavinia says, have everything all cleaned and the house spotless. Shoot, I've gone out with the coffee still in the coffee pot and the ground still in there, you know, and you come back and they're all moldy. <laughs> I don't mean to do that part, but I have done that, believe it or not. Really? Hazel, what's your... What's your um, what would you say is your favorite memory of you and mom when you were kids? I don't know. Let's see. Um, we fought a lot. That was the result. Did you? Oh, these are fights. <laughs> you remember we fought like you think. This just sounds like Tammy and Rhonda. They always did that. We fought a lot. I didn't think twins did that. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. I put her arm against the stove, didn't I? Burn her arm. Did you she, really? She's gonna leave. So then, um, then I started to cry, and I was I went running down the street to get her. <laughs> what? Well, how old would you guess you were then? Nine. Nine. Nine or ten. Yeah. Really? <laughs> really? Uh, I want to hear some of the truth about the stories I've heard about boyfriends and stuff. You know, where oh, you? Yeah, she'd make me mad when her and Bonnie Jean took off with their boyfriends to the show and dropped me off at the cozy corner. Really? They wouldn't take me. <laughs> they didn't want five along, right? Leave it alone. But I've I've heard rumors that you guys would one of you'd go out with a guy, and then if you didn't like him and he he asked out again, why you'd switch on him and the other one would go out with him oh, to see. Yeah, yeah, I heard stories about that. Yeah, I never no, no, I heard that somewhere. You just don't want it on record, do you? <laughs> No, really? Huh, I don't know where. I really thought I'd heard that. Hmm. But didn't didn't you go, didn't you switch off classes in school and take tests or something for each other? I had to take her one time. Did you? Yeah, I said to her. It was in science, I think it was, and, and she didn't know it, and we had, we had to stand up and report it, and she didn't. So I said to Marie, I'll, I'll sit, I'm sitting down beside of you, so you just stand up and I'll move my mouth. <laughs> oh, really? And it, and so you did it? Uh, we did it, but uh, the teacher knew better. Oh, no. They told us a month after. A month after that she knew you did it? Yeah. And when, uh, what you call it, died, uh, when Bob died, mm -hmm. with the funeral parlor, uh, who was it, the teacher was there. He came in, and he remembered that. Did he really? He that, yeah. Oh, wow. Were there any other twins in school when you guys were going to school? Any other sets no. of twins you knew of? No. no? Hmm. Did you ever date twins, guys that were twins? No? I've heard of girl twins marrying guy twins, you know. You hear that. Anyway, what was your, what's the favorite memory you remember, Mom? I remember none. You don't remember none? Sure you do. Think of one. Huh? I have to tell you my favorite one of Hazel, though. I think we talked about that the other days when, when she sent me the big white teddy bear. I'll never forget that as long as I live. I can remember it being delivered, and I was a little kid, and that box looked so huge. I thought, "Oh my goodness!" To a kid, the bigger the box, the big, you know, the bigger head the present had to be in it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the bigger the better. That was neat. I drug him around till he just literally rotted and fell apart. Hi, Justin. <sighs> well, it's a nice sunny day, and we hate to leave, but I guess we're gonna have to. We might just. 
Yeah, we sure will. We're gonna. That's uh, Bibi's uh, grandson. Justin, hmm. come here. Want to come get in the picture? We met Hazel's friend Erica and her mom the other day. Do they look like twins? Hi. That's her son, John, and that's a friend of ours. Get over, here. Get over there and let me see what you look like. I've got my head in the camera. Okay, hi. Hi. Can you tell us your name? Justin. Justin? How old are you, Justin? Oh, seven. Seven? Wow. My son's five and a half and thinks he's about seven and a half, or eight and a half. Seven. <laughs> what, do you, what do you do for fun around here, Justin? A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff? Like what? Huh? Stuff. Yeah, yeah he's that's little, fun. He's in the league. Is he? Yeah. yeah. Have you hit any home runs this year yet? Have you done home runs already, have you? I got a grand slam. Did you really? That's great. That's neat. Mom, can I have video camera? Were you born here? Have you always lived here in Rhode Island? Yeah. Have you? I was born right there. Right there, right huh? They live right upstairs. Oh, that's yeah. neat. They moved to have you traveled much? Been anywhere special? Yeah, Rocky Point. <laughs> yeah? You just came back last week from where? It's where I live. I live, we live in Florida. There's a nice place. Love Continental. They have a, the parent, the big I, I, don't, I don't ever want to like live in California. Don't you? Why? Earthquakes and might fall into the ocean. <laughs> That's true. That's really true. And all that big crack. Oh, wow. You might have all those people moving here to Rhode Island pretty soon if it keeps on doing it, huh? It'd get real crowded up here in Rhode Island. They'll be trying to get as far away as they can. What if, what if the people in all the whole world was in um, California and they moved all the whole world moved all the way, the whole world people moved all the way here? Yay! <laughs> you silly. They would be going in houses, don't know what to do. Maybe go swimming. <laughs> yeah, that'd be the thing go to do. Go swimming in your eyeball. <laughs> Did you go swimming a lot, Justin? Yeah, I just went swimming today. Did you? Did you yeah, have a salmon? Uh, yeah. Are you a good swimmer? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how to swim yet. Oh, you don't know how to swim yet? You're yeah, learning though? Johnny goes in the pool, but he puts water wings on, so he don't, so he don't sink. Just a nice beach, though, huh? Yeah. It's all that matters, as long as it's a nice beach. You can go swimming. Why did you build it a sand camp? I'm out of, out of sunburn too, huh? Look what this, the police gave me a bad junior police, Boston Police Department. Police departments? Really? Yeah, I got that yesterday in Boston. Yeah, and they took his picture on the motorcycle. <laughs> I did too. Yeah. Did you? What do you want to be when you grow up? I don't know. I don't know. know. Oh, fireman. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I want to be. Johnny thinks he's going to be a fireman and a policeman and a oh. uh, paramedic <laughs> all at one time. <laughs> don't, honey, don't. <laughs> I can, I can drive both the strokes at the same time. <laughs> I can put up the brakes on if I want to. Johnny, you want to just stay here and play with Justin? Can if I you go stay back? here. If I stay here. I'll come back and get you a couple months. No. No? <laughs> oh. Well, guys, I guess we ought to quit. Anything else you want to say, anybody? Oh, it's noisy over there. Hmm? Huh? Yeah, really, for sure. Yeah. Well, that's, yeah, I hope he gets all better, really. I mean, uh, it's over a week now. The way it goes down when he's in bed at night and then it's back up in the morning. You know what I mean? Mm hmm. Yeah. Could be fluid, too. Yeah. I took some of those pills yesterday. I should have put this all on recording here. <laughs> I guess we better go. 
you huh? don't know Make sure how. you got enough of gas now. Oh, I will. We'll fill up before we head down through through there. Lavinia's wanting to go through New York, and I'm I'm debating whether or not we'll take a route that goes that way or not. And Lenox City, they're open 24 hours now. Atlantic City. I might drop her off there. Leave her. Twenty-four hours now. <laughs> yeah, they, they they got their license. Twenty-four hours they're staying open. It was in a paper today. Really? Yeah, That's like Vegas, Vegas then. They don't even have clocks in Atlantic, Vegas. You can, yeah, it goes twenty-four hours a day yeah. for everything. You can eat breakfast at six in the evening or ten at night, or they you can have, have a steak dinner at six in the here. morning. Uh, goes. In, I think it's. I forget how much. It's thirty-five dollars. But then they give you ten dollars worth of quarters to play, and then you get, I think you get your meal, mm -hmm. and the bus takes you there. You leave early in the morning, but you don't come back till around uh, two or three in the next morning. Really? Yeah. So you stay all day and that all night you till don't really. Stay, uh, all night in the hotel or nothing. You're just there going, yeah. you know, trying to get there. Yeah, that must be neat. Lavinia, you know who to come get when you want to come up here and go. See? <laughs> Hazel's got it all checked out for you. <laughs> There's other people out of the uh, old people. Don't that really? Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Walter's well, brother went once, and uh, he said he'd never go again by bus because he had to go to work at 7 o'clock, and he didn't get in until 3 o'clock in the morning. Oh, no, and he, he had to be at work. If I was going to go again, he said I, I would drive and then stay overnight, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Well, we're going to take a little different route, I think, going back, just so we don't see the same old thing, you yeah, know. A right, yeah. little bit different anyway, so I just got to pick away and go and do it, I guess. Anyways, I'm going to sign off for now, and this is up here in Central Falls, Rhode Island, and it's a real pretty day, and... I wish we could stay longer, but maybe we'll do it again one day. I hope so. <laughs> really?